Hey everybody, I'm Not Great and welcome back to another episode of the Final Fantasy VI Pixel Remaster. It was just released today, I have streamed it for six hours today, and after eating a lovely dinner prepared by my wife, I did find out that I have been abusing our bandwidth a little bit. <laughs> just a little bit. <clears throat> Even though YouTube was telling me that I, my, my bitrate was not high enough, my ISP was saying, no, you're fine. Yeah. So, I'm gonna record this one instead, and give, uh, give everybody else in the house a chance to, you know, have the internet. So when we left off, we'd made it all the way through. There we go. Come on. What are you doing? Ode. There we go. <laughs> we made it all the way through Locke's story and Sabin's story, and now we have Terra and Edgar and, you know, that guy. Him. He's a, He's not a jerk, but he's, he's a grumpy... He's, he's, uh, and Bannon. So without further ado... With the Empire's troops in hot pursuit, Bannon, Edgar, and Terra ride the rapids towards Narsha, but the going won't be easy. Lesser Lopros. Alright, attack, tools, auto crossbow, ray. <laughs> Back again. Okay, no, we learned last time. If Bannon prays, that's it. All that Bannon does is pray. If Bannon does not pray, bad shit happens. Pray. Auto crossbow. You know what? Let's use some magic. Damn, even that. Wow. Dead. There we go. And Bannon gets a level up, and no one gives a damn. I know Sabin made it up to level 14 in the other run. I can't remember what level lock was. I want to say it was like probably 12 or 13. Hook him. Shoot him. Pray. Oh, Terra learned Drain. Nice. And she got a level up. Well, I guess... I guess those two things kind of have to go together. Um, anyways. Terra has hit level 12. Good for you, Terra. Alright. Let's equip everybody with their optimal shit. So I know for a fact that I bought too much armor during the live stream um, because it kept on showing me Bannon in my party. I was like, oh shit, and I was just looking at it. It's like, all right, I need to buy one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then after I bought an extra thousand gil worth of shit, it's like, oh yeah, one of those people is Bannon, and I can't even fuck with his armor, so. Yeah. Uh, you get the earring. Cool. That'll work for now. Uh, let's see. We could go straight to Narsha. What in the world? Oh, wow. My right joystick is also for walking. Alright. Just eliminate these things. Dead. 
dead. Good. The auto battle is really handy for bullshit encounters like that. <clears throat> All right. Um. Yeah, we'll go ahead and heal real fast. There we go. And save as well. So for anybody who wasn't watching the stream, or who hasn't watched the, the first couple of parts, if you jump in, it's like, man, I just want to skip all that really fun stuff and get into what a lot of people consider the most boring part of... Yeah. Ew, you're that Imperial officer from before. <clears throat> Please, I can explain. Get out of here now, or you'll regret it. You just hit that old dude. Let's not get hasty here. I'm King Edgar of Figaro... Liar punch! My goodness. And that, my friends, is why I can't stand men. Sure. It's like they don't even have ears. I'm sorry, it's all my fault. I mean, Tara, if you want, we can send you up there to get punched too, but... That won't do any good. Neither will the pity party. When Locke first rescued me, we came out of the mines right around here. He fiddled with something. A rock. He fiddled with a rock. Yes, he told me. Twist this stone like so, and... Boom! Where was I? Oh yeah, um... So a quick rundown of things in the game that you... You may not know about if you're just getting into the Pixel Remaster with this episode is one, the music fucking rocks. Just absolutely kicks ass. I mean, do you hear that? Uh, second is that there is an auto battle feature. I don't recommend using it unless you're just grinding for experience, AP, or money. But if you are, it's really handy to have. Uh, let's see, what else? Um, the, the text looks a little weird. It takes a little getting used to. Like, I feel like they could have upped the size of the font a bit, and they would have been fine. But they didn't. And, you know, it's not like you can't read it, but... Eh, it is what it is. Um, let's see... They... Everything is still pixelated. Let's check out the roof. Alright, no, we're, we can't do that. Um, but there's a lot more pixels per pixel, if that makes any sense. But they, they kept the art style, like, right. And then there's a lot more attention to detail, like, in the backgrounds. Especially in, like, the, the parallax backgrounds. The ones that move, like, the background that moves behind the background. And it usually moves a lot slower than the actual background. If you take my meaning. Oh. Okay, he's dead now. And a wild rat. Not a were rat. A wild rat. Okay, so these things are, are a little bit stronger than they were the first time. There we go. Still not giving me much uh, gold or experience, but whatever. Um, but yeah, you can kind of see, like, the textures look really true to the original. Even though they're, they're kind of blown up, but they don't look as... I don't know. It looks new and not new at the same time, is, I guess, what I'm trying to get at. Uh, tools, autocrossbow, everybody, pray. And if anybody's left, die. Nobody's left. Good. Edgar got a level up, though. Edgar is now level 13 and has broken the 300 HP threshold. Congratulations, Edgar. Gotta follow the thing. Follow the twinkly light. The 
This must be the place. What place? I heard of a cave they used to test applicants to the city guard. Seems this is it. We should be fine as long as we follow the light. If we make a mistake, lights will surround us. Then we'll have to tag the glimmering orange light to proceed. Oop, I went the wrong way already. Uh, oop. How am I fucking this up? I just, I need to, to re-follow that with my eyes, as I, I obviously, like, zoned out or some shit. Okay, that's, that's right. Got it. Probably. I don't know. We'll find out. What? Fuck off with that. What? I'm trying to remember if we can get Mog in this section. I want to say we can. But I could be wrong. I could be very, very wrong. Moogles. There's Mog. Koopo. Koopo, everybody. And I got a room blade. Oh, yeah, that's right. <laughs> Edgar doesn't care about swords. Edgar uses spears. And possibly the Atma weapon. Can I get back in there that way? No. The Spritzer and the Bandit. So these guys are the easy ones, I think. Yeah. Damn! Okay. <laughs> Note to self, don't piss Terra off. Alright, yeah, I can just fast forward through this one. So here's a good example. The battle goes double time. And everything is chosen just based off of what's going to end the fight fastest. And that's the uh, the super speed battle stuff. Once again. There is often also a little bit of overlap between when an attack ends and when the next one starts. At least compared to the original. And it makes battles feel a lot more fluid. God, my throat is so fucked. I've been... I've been talking so much today. Doing voices for Kefka and shit. Yeah. Like, I don't even know if I can do Kefka voice. Right now. <sighs> but I'm planning on getting to him, so... Uh. Hey, old guy. Except your name is actually Arvis. Hi, Arvis. Bannon, King Edgar. Oh, and Terra too. Arvis, how do things stand here in Narshit? Same as always, the town's neutral. I've tried to convince them to side with the Returners, but it's no use. Of course, maybe with you and the King of Figaro here, we just got punched in the fucking gut, literally, by these assholes. I have doubts. How are the townspeople? Everyone's been a little on edge since the Esper was discovered. We believe Terra may be able to help us get answers to our questions about the Esper. Well, the townspeople still have plenty of questions of their own. If we approach them in the right way, there's a good chance they'll agree to let her see it. I have doubts. That Esper is either going to save us or dig us an early grave. Well, hopefully, 
it's the good one of those. Whichever one is the good one entirely depends on your... The three groups have arrived in Narsha, and now a decisive battle is about to unfold. Damn it, I didn't even get to level them up, like, fucking at all. I understand what you're saying, but you're asking us to spill our blood for you. That's not what we asked. But it will be the result. Uh... <laughs> you're absolutely right. Anon. We're asking you to spill your blood. Emperor Gestal is racing to acquire ever greater Magitek power. That's the reason he wants the Esper that was discovered here. If we allow the Empire to continue expanding its Magitek arsenal, history's greatest mistake will be repeated. Ugh. War of the Magi. A legendary conflict that laid waste to the world. Ooh. You're saying it could happen again? I thought humans to be wiser creatures. You were wrong! Edgar! Seven, you're all right. And you've brought a strange older man and an even stranger small child with you. <laughs> Who have you brought along? I am Cyan, a warrior of the kingdom of Doma. Cow. <laughs> the Empire killed everyone in Doma, down to the last child. Kefka poisoned them. Barbaric! Dead, big face. Elder! But that was because Doma was collaborating with the Returners. As long as Nyarsha remains neutral, Nyarsha remains neutral, we have nothing to fear from the Empire. Think again! Lock! The Empire is poised to attack Narsha as we speak. What? Lock, where did you manage to get your hands on information like that? Celis here was one of the Empire's gener... So it is her! I thought she looked familiar. Sir Gao, step aside! Hey, don't hit children. The infamous General Celis. The woman single-handedly responsible for the sack of Miranda. Stand and meet thy judgment, Imperial wretch! Oh, there. Zealous has promised to join the Returners. She's fighting on our side now. Be that as it may! I promised I'd protect her, and I won't give up a woman I've sworn to protect. Locke, you still haven't gotten over that, have you? Edgar, shut the fuck up. I was also an Imperial soldier. What? The Empire is evil, but that doesn't mean that all of its citizens are. Cyan. I'm going to have to defer to my brother on this one. <laughs> the Empire is marching on Narsha. We don't have long. telling me. I thought I had more chance to level up. <laughs> Fuck. Alright. I don't care what you have to do, just get me that Esper. Says Kefka. Oh, I didn't do his voice. Kefka, sir, what about the civilians? What about them? Kill them all! But sir, Narsha is a neutral city. Idiot! Read my lips! Mercy is for wimps! There's a reason a pose rhymes with dispose. If they get in our way, kill them! March! That hurts. Seems the choice has been made for us. Let us make ready for war. They're here for the Esper. We moved it up into the cliffs above the valley. That's where we're going, then. Oh, there, yeah. Then that's where we'll make our stand. <laughs> I am no voice actor. Don't go fail falling for him now, thinking he was protecting you out of love back there. 
Thanks for your concern, but I'm a soldier, not some love-starved twit. So much for my next suggestion. You thirsty fucker. Up, oh, girl time. Tara, who would have thought we'd meet again like this? You can use magic too, can't you? But it's different from mine. I was raised to be an Imperial Magitech Knight. When I was still very young, I was artificially infused with magic. Is it possible for you to love other people? Uh, uh, <laughs> are you mocking me? No, she's not, I promise. Do not think even for a moment that I trust thee. Fine, use your own eyes. See for yourself which side I'm on. All right, here we go. Oh, wrong button. All right, Terra, equip. Optimal, cool. Um, I'm gonna be going all out with your magic, so just fuck off with that. Okay. There we go. Oh shit, I need to go back to Terra actually. He's got the gauntlet on and the Hermes sandals. I like the combo to a point, but not too much of one. Keep the Hermes sandals. Use the air knife. Uh, Magus hat. There we go. Magic up. Yeah, we're going. We're going full on nuke the shit out of people with magic. Uh, let's see. Equipment. Sell this. Optimal. Equip. Uh, she can't wear a Magus hat? Did I buy her a Magus hat? That's fucked up. Okay. Uh, magic evasion plus ten. She doesn't need that because she can absorb magic. Um, not that that really matters in this, though. So, yeah, we'll let her keep it. She's only level 12. Alright, Cyan, just in case. Little hyper wrist and sniper eye. Sure. Edgar! Wrist, cool. Um, what if I gave you Vegas Club as well? You don't need that. You actually don't even need the hyper wrist. Um, star pendant. Like you don't need any of that shit. Seven equip optimal. Uh, yeah, we'll let you keep the nice code and the mithril glove. That's a good combo for you. Go. Go, go. Go, go. Go, go. Alright. <clears throat> Physical attack power up. Yes. Hyper is. Yes. You're gonna go fucking crazy, dude. <laughs> Just absolutely bonkers. And it's gonna be awesome. Alright, no going back. Hopefully I can nail this on the first shot. Are you ready? <sighs> yes. Protect the Esper from Kefka. Uh, yes. You'll fight using three different parties. Use the L button, which is the left trigger in this case, to switch between them. Defeat Kafka before his men reach Bannon, or the battle is lost. After you've made three parties on the party formation screen, select Done to start the battle. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So one party gets three people. Alright, let's organize you guys by level first. So you're low level, you're high level, 
You're mid level. You're high level. You're mid level. Stop it. You're high level. And you're 11, 12, 13, 14, 14, 14. All right. <clears throat> so I want you guys each to be with. There we go. Uh, that's a nuking party. That's kind of a nuking party. Alright, so we have heals here, we have heals there. We don't have heals here, but we have Gao and Sabin. So, <laughs> and then Locke can hopefully uh, hold his own. So, <sighs> alright. Let's call it a thing. Let's do it. Here they come. It is isn't General Zealous, a traitor! Excellent. Now I won't have to hunt you down later. <laughs> Dick. Go! Get those vile insects! Is the bucket still there? Yeah. So I can heal whenever I damn well please. There we go. So that helps. Hunting Hound and Corporal. All right. Uh, Blitz. Rage. Templar. And Steel just for fun. Fuck it. This will probably be the party that I go up against Kefka with. So I can steal shit. Fire 2. Dead. Yeah, it's a pretty nuky party. Gained a level. He's up to level 12 now, but still beneath 300 AP, er, uh, HP. All right, switching. Yeah, you guys ain't shit. I think I was worried for nothing. At least for this front line. This front line is nothing. Alright, Cyan! You and Terra are next. Same shit, different day. Bushido Fang, go! Magic. Fire. Go. God, stop picking on her. One down. There you go, Terra. Just doing Fang for fun at this point. Run. 
run back and heal real fast. I could just use a healing item, but... I mean, free is free, right? Yoink. That's it for all the green ones. I think this is my weakest party. on her, you assholes. And I am in the the weight battle style, but um, it barely feels like it. There you go. All right, run back and heal. And we'll take on one of the uh, the brown shirts. For funsies. There we go, there's a Fidor. All right, one hit kill. There we are. You should be dead. There we go. And this is easier than like XP farming. All right, let's swap over. Boink. To the boys. really did not like that guy. He really did not like that guy. There we go. And one more. And then we'll switch. Oh, hell yeah. Come on. There you go. Stole the potion, all right. I forget what a moo is, but let's try that. Snare, there we go. Bye. You gonna snare that one too? Yeah, you are. Is that... I don't think that cut down on my experience at all. Cool. All right. All right. Celis and Edgar. Team Blonde. Else is already shit. Oh no. Why does he have reflect on? Ow. Alright, we're gonna heal. Survive. Shit. Magician, heal thyself. There we go. Let's go, Bio Blaster. Well, oh, Edgar's dead. All right. He 
cute shit. And Edgar's back. Alright, let's try that again. That didn't go as well as I was... <laughs> as I would have thought. Freeze, puppy. Ow. And stab. There you go. Then I go heal again and then switch back over to Cyan. Wait, is that everybody? Oh, this guy. Um, I need to get lock up here for this one. What is this shit? Shortcut? Ah. No! There we go. Okay, good. I got Hell's Rider. Alright. Steel. Uh, Rage. We want to go... We'll go Vector Hound. How about that? We'll be a dog. Suplex. Mithril Vest. Fuck yeah. Ow. There you go. Thank you, Seven. Let's see if we can get off his special attack. No, oh, okay. Gonna try and get off Locke's special attack. Or not. It's... We very well may not do that. And then we're gonna heal. Alright, equip. Sabin with the Mithril Vest. Really? There we go. Here we go. Fuck this guy. Alright, um, I liked what was going on with the Vector Hound, so we'll stick with that. We got a steal. Got a suplex. Oh shit, he's floating. There we go, high ether. You got bit. Damn. Don't kill him. He died. Uh, let's see. Yeah, we'll bring him back. No, 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 no. That's not gonna end well. Yeah, let's hit it. <laughs> That's, that is the best possible outcome for this. Wow, all right. There we go. Yeah, he's just gonna keep on trying to cast Berserk on. And attack, why not? Don't think you've won. Flee! That's okay. At least you get a peace ring. I won't forget this. Ah. Where's the Esper? Is it all right? Yeah, we didn't let anybody get anywhere near the fucking Esper. 
We annihilated a small army with seven people. We are awesome. Phew, Esper's safe. It also appears to be alive. Is that even possible? Uh oh. Tara, what is it? Oh, there. No! Oh, shit. Terra and the Esper. They're reacting to each other. this I'm feeling. <laughs> Did you say something? Please, tell me. Who am I? Who? Except, you know, in a feminine voice. Para! The Esper. It's responding to her. Terra. Get away from that thing! Oh yeah, I remember this now. Terra loses her shit and her clothes. I feel like they made this sprite just for this sequence. Went up to the Triangle Island, there's nothing there. And... Run around the tower. Are you awake? Where's Terra? She turned into, a uh, something and flew off. She looked like... She looked like an Esper. Oh, okay. Right, my headphone cable's getting caught up in my jacket. Locke, are you okay? Something happened to Terra. There must be some connection between her and that Esper. We need to find her. Witnesses said she went streaking westward across the sky, beyond Figaro. And that's where we're going. We've got to hurry. I promised I'd protect her. Locke. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. The Empire will be back again for that Esper. And someone needs to protect Bannon. Ugh. She is a former Imperial soldier. But still, we must help her. Nod. Let's split up. Those who aren't searching for Terra will stay here to guard against further attacks. Figaro Castle can shuttle the others to the Western Province. Shouldn't be hard to track down clues in Kolinjin or Jadur as to Terra's whereabouts. You can only form one party. I need magic. I need you, and I want you. Yep, sorry, gal. You're nice and all, but I like having more control over my people. Ugh. 
And these two especially need some level, some leveling up. Here we go. Eh, I'll be fine. Can I get Mog yet? Let's find out. Actually, I want to go talk to those two real fast. If Gal would get out of the fucking way. I heard Terra turned into a ball of light and shot away to the west. Perhaps someone at Figaro Castle saw where she went. Please find Terra. The future of the world rests in her hands. See if we can nab us a Moogle. Run, 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 run. Don't even care about saving. I mean, not right right now. I definitely care about saving. There we go. But I, I ain't gonna die in here. So, I'm not worried. Listen to that saxophone, man. Dear lord. Oh, oh. Nope, all the other Moogles are still here, so. No getting Mog yet. It's not even that late. I don't know why I'm yawning. Other than I've been doing this all day. Of course, I forgot that Terra disappears after that fight, and I gave her the strongest sword that I have. And there she was on the safe thing, just mocking me. Like, ah, I got your sword. See what's around town. Alright, that chest in the back corner is the only one that's locked. I wonder if there's a way to open it. Maybe. It's locked. I'm locked. Ah, fine. Thieves knife. Earring. $5,000. Reflect ring. Thief's bracer. Hyper wrist. There we go. I like that. Give you the hyper ring or hyper wrist. Cellus can go nuke Lear on us, with us, for us, whatever. I am literally a thief. Why can't I not open this?
Narsha is a neutral city. We've taken no part in the war, yet we're still not spared from the Empire's aggression. No, nobody is. That's kind of part of their thing. Oh, nothing in that clock. Wow. That's really disappointing. I, I remember more clocks having, like, elixirs in them. Wheel coming. Alright, we're good there. Any green arrows? One, two, three, four. There we go. No, thank you, sir. Items. Potions to keep there were good. Smoke bombs. Don't care. Gold needle. There we go. Phoenix down were good. Sleeping bag tent were good. Alright. You are welcome. Alright, relics. I have to see if I can steal anything from your shop, old man. Don't need that. Still don't need any sprint shoes, though. And we may have just screwed ourselves on our weapon budget, but we will find out. Goes through here. Oh yeah. Great sword, mithril claws, kotetsu, mithril spear, air knife, chain flail, alright. But she can't do runic if she doesn't have a sword, I don't think. And we want to keep the thief knife on you. Uh, we'll go ahead and buy one of each for now. to do with runic right now, so we'll give her the flail. We had just enough money to shop. Saw a ball of light shoot off towards Figaro Castle. That's our friend. That's our health. It's a little bit low for some reason. All right, and we are right at an hour, so we are going to wrap it up there. There we go. Let's get out to a nicer tableau than just that one room. There we are. <laughs> oh, man. Whoa. Anyways. Thank you all for watching. I enjoyed having you here. I hope that you got to see the two episodes before this. A little over six hours full of just going. From as soon as I got back from dropping my car off at the shop this morning to right before I had dinner. A small break for lunch in between. We went and went. There was laughter. There were tears. Cyan's family died. Just a little bit of both. Can you see? Yeah, you can see my mouse. Hi. Um, <laughs> that was six hours and that was a marathon. This has been one hour. It has not been a marathon, but I am still fucking tired. I might do one more hour after this. I don't know. Either way, I'm going to start streaming again tomorrow morning. And either, either way, 
I hope you all have a good night or day, what have you, as you are watching this. And I hope to see you again next time for more Final Fantasy VI The Pixel Remaster. Have a good one.